What is going on guys? Jelani from JelaniTheMarketer.com here back again with another video and in this video I'm going to be talking about Ecom Lite and how you can use it to find winning dropshipping products for quarter four. Now if you're not familiar with Ecom Lite, Ecom Lite is a service that allows you like I said to find winning products so you don't have to go on AliExpress and really um, go through all that time to find those products. This service allows you to quickly find products, winning products at that so you can just go out there and test. All right, so um, I actually have a video that I did a few weeks ago or a few months ago talking about Ecom Lad more in depth. But in this video, I'm just going to talk how quickly you can find these products because um, it's really important to a have an edge over your um, competitors. I'm going to talk about that as well, but also that you're not spending that much time testing or finding those products and hoping that they are you know winners. Where you can just go out on on Ecom Lad and test products that you know are winners and have that validation in terms of um, selling. So. This is what Ecom Lad is, but before we get into it, hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. If you're interested about dropshipping, I'm always talking about dropshipping, and I always have um, some really cool things coming um, about dropshipping. So hit that alert button so you know when I release a new video. All right, so let's get into it. So like I said, Ecom Lad is a really cool service, and what they do is they have different pricing structures. Okay, so they'll have a like gold pricing structure, diamond pricing structure. They'll have a, um, I think a low in pricing tier structure. And the point of this, um, this is like my first point is having that competitive edge is you don't want everyone to be testing the same products that you are, right? Like you want to have that one slight edge over that person. Therefore you can be ahead of them when Q4 hits and we're already in Q4. So you should be thinking about these things anyway. Um, but once it hits, you want to make sure that you have that competitive edge. And when you have products that are not available to other people, or you have some type of um, in that another person doesn't have an in, in, you are going to have that edge over that person, meaning that you will make more money in the long run. So they price, or they price it in that way, so that they show you products depending on the tier that you want. So, for example, I'm in the gold tier, so the diamond products are not available to me. So if I scroll down here, different products are not going to be available, meaning I can't click on this product. I don't know what the product is. I don't know, you know, the, the ad copy. I don't know the images. I don't know where to get it from. I don't know any of that, right? But what I do know is the gold products. I know the silver products. So I can just scroll down Ecom Lad really quickly and just find products that I think will do well. So if you have a general store or a niche store, it really doesn't matter. There's always products in here um, for any type of store. So you just scroll down and I'm gonna look for a product that I think, in my opinion, would do really well. Um, so I'm just gonna scroll down here then I can give you guys an example in terms of uh, what happens once you click on a product, right? Like what do you see? What information do you get? Why is it worth um, investing in this product? Um, so let's see if we can find something really cool. But like I said, you just keep scrolling. Um, and if you wanna get a copy of Ecom Lab, just click the link below actually. Um, and you could try it out for yourself. Like there's, you don't have to go for the gold. You don't have to go for silver or diamond. I think there's a really low pricing plan, so you can kind of get introduced to the product. And then as you start to see different products that you may like to test, then you can advance if you like. So click that link below if you want that. Um, so let's see here. Let's keep looking. Let's keep looking. I like this one. Um, it's a wine glass wash holder, and I'll tell you the reason why I like this product. Um, for a few reasons, just because I know, just by looking at it, I know it's cheap. Not cheap in the sense of quality, but cheap to um, buy, so I'm not spending that much money. And then the, my net profit will be higher, right? So when you click on a product, you're gonna get a image. It's gonna tell you when it was posted, what tier it is. Um, and these images are generic images. They're from AliExpress. So another way, this is the second way you can have an edge over your competitors is order the product in advance and shoot your own videos, shoot your own pictures, so that you have unique images, unique content that other people do not have, right? Like everyone who is testing these products are doing the same thing that you possibly are doing, right? Going on AliExpress, ripping off the, the images or going to different people's stores, ripping off the images and it, everyone's the same, right? Like what makes you different? What sets you apart from everyone else? And that's really, really important. Um, so yes, you can have success with using the AliExpress images, but it's really important that you have a competitive edge over your um, other other dropshippers or other people that are in your niche or in your industry, right? Um, so when you click on the the product, you'll see the the different um, profits that you can po potentially make. So you can see the selling price, you can see the product cost, the shipping, the profit margin, the CPA. So um, how much it costs to actually get someone to go through with that purchase, um, and then you also see the net, right? Like how much money you can potentially make. Now 
this is kind of crucial because it's not something that you want to kind of live by. Uh, I would say test different price points, test different things. Um, but I like this product because it's so cheap. I can get it for $3.20 and I could go different angles. Like I can make this a free plus ship product, put it in a funnel and then upsell people, right? Like I can do that. I can sell it as is. Like I can sell it for $17.99, um, you know, full price. So there's different ways you can go about that. So that's really cool as well. Um, they do give you a generic description, but you obviously want to make your own. They show you where the store or what different stores are selling them. So like if you click on this, you could go to that store and see um, your competitor or see like different products that they're selling and kind of get some more information um, about that. Um, they show you the AliExpress link, how many orders, again, the product costs, the shipping, etc. They also show you the um, where Geo is most likely to buy this. So the United States, Germany, Canada are probably the most likely people to buy this product. So you can test that out to see if that's actually true. You might find a geo that works really well and it's not listed here. So don't limit yourself to the things that they're saying. This is just a great foundation and starting point for you to start testing, right? Like it's all about minimizing the time it takes to find these products so you can get them out there and say if, if something hits, you can scale harder than your competitors, right? So that's really um, awesome as well. And then also they give you the Facebook ad and some ad copy and targeting suggestions. But again, like you don't want to just rip these products or the images or, or the videos. Like you want to give yourself an edge by, um, you know, filming your own videos or shooting your own pictures so that other people uh, don't have what you have, right? So keep that in mind. So the targeting as well is something that they do for you so they can give you um, some generic idea like this is not tested it tells you hasn't been tested so keep that in mind as well you just kind of want to use this as a foundation to kind of get yourself on the ground running and then you can test different things but you know these products are winners because they're on here they tell you the date they tell you some vital information so that you can get that edge over your competitors scale faster and just hit the market quicker right that's the whole point of this is you have to reach the market before your competitors do. And if you have an edge over them, you're going to do really well for quarter four. People are looking for products. They're looking to spend money quarter four. You know, all the holidays, Christmas, um, Thanksgiving, uh, all, all these different holidays are coming up, right? Like, so you have to start thinking about, all right, well, th this can be a great gift. Or how am I going to increase my average order value and complement this product, right? So think about all this stuff will help you in the long run and Ecomly is just another tool that will help you have success quicker than your competitors. So if you guys like this tool, you like this um, overview, like I said, I have another video um, going more in depth about um, the pricing structure and all that stuff. So click the link below for that. But also if you want a copy of this product, just click the link below um, so that you can get access to this. Like I said, there's different pricing structures so you don't have to go for the most expensive one. You can kind of fill it and test it out to see what works for you. All right, guys? So I hope this helped you out to kind of open your mind and broaden your horizons in terms of what to expect in quarter four because quarter four can either make you or break you and I hope that it makes you, right? So click that link below if you want to get Ecom Lad. Um, if you guys haven't subscribed yet, definitely subscribe. Hit that alert button so you know when I release new videos. If you have any suggestions at all, let them be known in the comment section. Let me know if I talk too fast, if, you know, if the audio is not good, anything like that so I can make these videos better for you because I make these videos for you so there's no point um, not taking your suggestions, right? And last but not least, give me a thumbs up if you like this video. I really appreciate it. Thank you guys so much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.